Hey everybody, 204 here, back again. We're gonna go very easily kill a war chief. Defeat the war chief's bodyguards for your thing. I've already done that. Well, sort of. Kill the Uruks with lightning speed to draw the war chief's thunder. I don't wanna do that. that sounds awful. Kill five Uruks in 45 seconds. Go ahead! Get in by some I can actually probably do that. There! A task! A what? This is the end. Right, this is the end. Just as we begin for you. One. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, I guess. Okay, here it goes. Uh, two. Stop shaking. Three, four, and crap. Uh, well, this will do, I guess. Hey. And five. Mission accomplished. Oh, shit. Too bad you're vulnerable to stealth finishers. Sucks to be you! Just in case the great walker's jumping down on you. How do I make them? Fight for me! That's how it's done. Dead! Easy peasy! I guess you can step up, that's fine. Whatever. That coward ran away. That is two war chiefs of mine. Two in the pot. Ready to go. We be fast and they be slow. So, uh <clears throat> That is another war chief taken care of. I actually kinda wanna gain intel on another one. Actually, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go do Torvin's mission over here. Because I don't know, some of you like it. I'm gonna open my drink. You ready for it? Ready, ready, ready. Ah. That soda me goodness. Sodom. Sodom. Sodium me goodness. And during this cutscene with Torvin, I'm totes gonna drink it. Totes. I'm totally gonna drink it. You're right. Oh, hey, we actually have an ability to unlock, so let's get that actually real quick. Death threat, fire arrow, wraith blast, meh, shadow mount, crap, I can't actually get shadow mount. Combat drain. What's the point of that? Throwing daggers, last chance. Finisher. I mean, I guess if things ever get that bad, but they haven't, so I'm not too worried about it. Pin in place. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll get this. Whatever. Wait, do I have another point? Oh my god, I have two points available. Sweet. I'm gonna get shoulder charge then. Let's check out a medium. I would like more health. Okay, well, I guess that's all I can get. <laughs> Alright, up this hill. I assume this is a Torben mission. Oh, well, I pressed a button, it just happened to be that one. Should have branded him, but whatever. Not a big deal, slaves are free now. Let's watch a cutscene! Hope you're not put off by my wee scars. No, not at all. I actually have a few of my own. <laughs> oh, I'll bet. What type of battle scars did you get from a black gate, eh? Splinters! <laughs> oh, or did you uh, scar your voice telling your soldiers to head into battle? Tread lightly. My scars run very deep. Huh. The mighty Grog. You give me these. 
And he also took my hunting partner. So what now? Well, another lesson for you, my captain. <clears throat> Maybe you'll even come out of this one on Scar. <laughs> So, what backward lesson do you have planned this time, eh? Shooting Krabain to prepare us for the mighty Graug? You want to hunt Graug? Then so you shall. But not just any Graug. This is a rare one. It's territorial. Strong enough to claim land as its own. And you and me, we're trespassing. Tell me, Captain. You ever slay a Graug before? Today will be the first of many. Now you're talking like a hunter. I've got a feeling in my gut you may survive this, Captain. Oh, since that's the largest part of you, I like those odds. So I assume you have a plan to kill this Graug? I do, Captain. And since you're so good at taking orders, I'll tell you how, step by step. Step one, when he's crunching on an Uruk, sneak up behind the giant beast and bleed the bastard's ankle. But why not his throat? There is one place Graugs aren't covered in spiky scales. They don't call a weakness a Graugs heel for nothing. You want me to sidle up to this beast? If you can manage it without being crushed, yes. There it goes. What a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. Graug blade. <clears throat> Here goes your thing. I've got to pierce its ankle if I want to bleed it. Doesn't actually know I'm here, does it? Oh god, it's <laughs> ah. How am I not supposed to be detected? You can sniff me. What a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. Uh, okay, well, here it goes. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I was pressing X, because I'm using a PlayStation controller. When in reality, it wanted me to press square, which is what X is. Technically. So that one was on me. My bad. You don't see nothing. Son of a bitch. I'll get it, guys. I'll get it. Jump, fool. I know, I know. A lot harder than I imagined. There it, it goes. What a fine, fine. I know it's a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. Unbelievable. There it goes. What a. Fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. Son of a bitch! There it goes. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Whoa, what did I just do? <laughs> no! Okay, I'm gonna get back to where I was. Hang on. What a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. This thing finishes its job in like 10 seconds flat. It's crazy. Captain, bleed his ankle. You should have taken notes. Um. 
There we freaking go! Jesus Christ! Holy fuck, that was close. That will be quite a ride. Oh god, it just fucked up that Karagor. I need a Karagor for speed. Hi, come here, you. I am invincible during these frames. B. Sounds easy enough. Right on, Captain. Come on, you. Come here. Hey, you. I've slain bigger crowds when I was a wee boy and my beard was only three inches long. And three. Shoot it in the head. <laughs> This vantage point is awful. Ah! Uh. What's step four? There is no step four. It should be dead. You must have done it wrong. I'm following your orders. Well, that's your problem. Think for yourself. Uh I have an idea. What are you doing? You can't ride the crowd. Hey now. Hey. Ah. Oh god. Uh oh Jesus that's close. Let's see. You attack enemies in an area and then eat them. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry, Grog friend. That was not very nice of me. Yummy. Bonus objective complete! Yummy, 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 yummy. Every day I'm hustling. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Hustling is not something I'm currently doing. Life ends with the sting of my blade. I see. It's a wee bit unusual to ride the ground. Something like a little improvising, eh? <laughs> All right, Captain. That's it. You showed instinct, gumption, respect. <laughs> Training's over. Got guts. Let's go spill some, hey? Apparently, this speaker over here is still on. I just heard it. Hopefully, that hasn't been a problem the last, like, <clears throat> this Immortal doesn't seem to touch that dwarf. The Seven Rings of Power did not turn the Dwarf Kings to wraiths, as the Nine Rings did to man. They are a stubborn as stone and cannot be dominated by evil. That is why Sauron has sworn to destroy them. Anyway, uh, I forgot my timer again, so I don't know how long this episode's been going on, but I think we're about to be dropping up point. If I'm wrong, then I'm sorry. Thank you so much for watching. I've been two or four, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. We're gonna go do some more stuff with Torvin. Just kind of get out of the way so we can focus on the War Chiefs and finishing up this game. Hopefully by next Friday. So we're gonna move on to the next project, the next big thing, which. I think I know what it is, but I'm saving it. 
So thank you so much for watching. I've been to before. I'll catch you guys in the flip side. Bye!